So, race four on your card, the Red Rum Handicap Chase over two miles here at Aintree. It's a great three handicap, so answer lane for Hems along with Gwen Tamara. And one and two, Ignatieff Kalanisi, James Shea, winner last week of the Grand Annual. Shanghai Lily of Pontypool Racing, capable carding into Martin Leedon with Blackmore Instrument, Maximus Galacticus, Paul Rhodes, Lone Star for Paul O'Neill, Mr. Tiffany Weeks for Pontypool Racing, Franklin Roosevelt for Paul Rhodes, Balathio Rhythm for Daniel French, First Eleven for Darren Thompson, Mayerson for Tam King, Force Horizon for Leon Van Rangsburg, Glenn Dew for Alex Cherry, Dominatrix for Joshua Sutherland, and a letter for Eric Hinton, and Double Cross for Ryan Costello, along with Wolfhound of Derek Hinton's of 19. The start has gone on more weight. We'll just start on. Slight turn, not inconvenience anybody, and we're going to wait from into the first of the 11 fences, and everybody's over it. And leading the Red Rum handicap chase here is Ignatieff Kalanisi, a good couple of lengths from Arthur Lane and first 11, and driven along to keep the lead. Ignatieff Kalanisi. Lance Lane is moving a little bit closer now as we get over the second. The leaders are over it, as is the remainder. They all took that well here. You see the ground being uh, good to firm today. There's obviously some rain dew laid up, which uh, will hopefully soften the ground for tomorrow's Grand National. They get over the third. They're all over it. A really poor jump there by Franklin Roosevelt. He shuffles way back down the pack. Could even have been Maximus Galacticus, but I think it was Franklin Roosevelt. So Ignatieff Kalanisi, still in the leaders, That's the big screens and the crowd over the fourth. And he jumps it well, couple towards the rear, and we lost Annaletta there. He's gone for Del Hinton. Didn't quite see the fence. It's Ignatieff Kalanisi that still leads us as we go out for another circuit from Answer Lane. We've got first 11 and Mayerson. Length or so back to Mr. Tibby Winks. And we've got the four rose horses, Maximus Galacticus and Franklin Roosevelt. They're a length and a half away from Force Horizon up against the fence. And he's outside Gwen Tamara, capable of carting and Blackmore instrument. And a further length back to Wolfhound and Glen Dew. Shanghai Lily, Blathia rhythm up against the fence. And the Dominatrix being driven along for a couple of strides. And we can't see Lone Star and Double Crossed. And as we get to the next, it's still Ignatieff Kalanisi. That's going to lead them over it with Arts Lane and Mayerson on his tail. And then a length or so back to Mr. Tiddlywinks has gone into a better position to go over the fifth. Poor jump by Ignatieff Kalanisi there. Has allowed Mayerson to jump alongside. The one that's moved out of the pack now is Mr. Tiddlywinks to throw down a bit of a challenge. And first 11 is outside. Arts Lane start. Oh, and a poor jump there by Arts Lane as he was starting to drift backwards. Maximus Galacticus hanging on to this. First group have pulled away a little bit here as they go over the seventh. The leaders are all over it, as is the rest. It's still Ignatieff Kalanisi as they're going to swing left handed now. Long swing and line up for the judges. Ignatieff Kalanisi put under pressure now by Mayus and first 11. Mr. Tibby Winks, Maximus Glasters, and Franklin Roosevelt as they all get over that one. We lost one there. Force Horizon's gone, which is unlucky for Leon Van Rensburg. Running on well now is Capable Cardington, but it's Ignatieff Kalanisi inside the final half a mile. Leads by a length and a half to Mayus. Still pushing out of the pack is Franklin Roosevelt, Mr. Tiddly Winks, first 11, Maximus Galacticus and Cable Cardigan. Here comes, I think, I'm not sure, in the orange silks of uh, Blackmore Instrument, but they've all still got to catch this leader as we come down to a quarter mile. It's Ignati F. Kalanisi by a length from Franklin Roosevelt. Mason starts to go back, was on the outside is Blackmore Instrument. He didn't get over that well, Ignati F. Kalanisi. With just one to jump, it's Franklin Roosevelt that just noses in front with Ignati F. Kalanisi on the inside. Mason on his out on the side, Blackmore Instrument, Maximus. Galacticus pushing through Mr. Tiddlywinks, but it's Franklin Roosevelt and Blackmore Instrument, but it's Blackmore Instrument takes the last together, but it's Franklin Roosevelt pushing through Mr. Tiddlywinks, Mr. Tiddlywinks, Mr. Tiddlywinks from Maximus Galacticus, Mr. Tiddlywinks takes it from Maximus Galacticus, Blackmore Instrument. A good win there for Graham Clutterbuck. I had a winner for a while, I was unlucky at Cheltenham. I don't know why the stewards in, but he did push his way through there. But he still hangs on to it. Mr. Tibby Winks takes it. For Pontypool Racing from Maximus Galacticus, Paul Rhodes in second. Third was Blackmore Instrument for Martin Leland. Fourth was Franklin Roosevelt for Paul Rhodes. And fifth was Mayerson for Tam King. A good finish there for the Red Rump. And I'll hand you over to Martin for race five.